All right, so we're just gonna hop right into it. This is how I draw eyes. So I'm just gonna do this quick little design and go ahead and draw an eye for you all so you see what I'm talking about. To show that I know what I'm doing, right? And a few more eyes, little decoration. Okay, let's get into it. First things first, use reference, especially if you're a beginner. Eyes are the window to the soul, right? And they're gonna help you express your character. It helps with, you know, um, what's that word? Character acting. And it should be easy to use these techniques that I'm gonna show you in your own style. And like I was saying with the character acting, emotion begins with the eyes, sometimes, right? So you have the shape of the, you know, the eyelids along with the eyelashes. And it is important to understand the anatomy of the eye. That way you're able to basically have them look the way that you want them to without reference once you understand the anatomy, right? So um, the eye is a sphere with eyelids, lashes, and eyebrows. And understanding the volume of the eyeball will make it easier to create the eye in any perspective. Also, here are some good, or some, here is a good exercise for practicing eyes. You just want to draw an empty face. Go ahead and put some eyes on it. And it's good to draw the faces at, in a couple of perspectives so you can see how the eye will look straight on and from the side. And here's a rule of thumb. Eyes are like eyebrows. They're sisters, not twins. So they don't have to look exactly alike. You want to learn how to draw a realistic eye and then simplify it into your desired style. Each eye will likely carry the same idea. You have the eyeball, pupil, eyelashes, and eyelids. Now when I draw an eye, I start with the eyelids and I follow it up with the pupil. The eyelids serve as a sort of container and then I can place the eyeball inside to further tie down the desired look. With this, you can see how simple and easy it is to go ahead and create a blinking animation. It's only two frames, eyes open, eyes closed. Anybody could do it. And yeah, it's easier than you think. And here are some examples just to wrap this thing up of using eyes for character expressions. Stuck around for this short video. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know if you want any more videos similar to this one or if you have any questions or comments, drop one below.